Hi, I'm reading the Emerald Tablets. This is the final chapter called The Secret of Secrets. I hope you enjoy it. Now ye assemble my children, waiting to hear the secret of secrets, who shall give you power to unfold the Godman, give you the way to eternal life. Plainly shall I speak of the unveiled mysteries, no dark saying shall I give unto thee. Open thine ears now, my children, hear and obey the words that I give. First I shall speak of the fetters of darkness, which bind ye in chains to the sphere of the earth. Darkness and light are both of one nature, different only in seeming, for each arose from the source of all. Darkness is disorder, and light is order. Darkness transmuted is light of the light. This, my children, your purpose in being, transmutation of darkness to light. Hear ye now of the mystery of nature, the relations of life to the earth where it dwells. Know ye, there are threefold in nature, physical, astral and mental in one. Three are the qualities of each of the natures, nine in all, as above, so below. In the physical are these channels, the blood which moves in vertical motion, reacting on the heart to continue its beating. Magnetism which moves through the nerve paths, carrier of energies to all cells and tissues. A casa which flows through channels, subtle yet physical, completing the channels. Each of the three attuned with each other, each affecting the life of the body. From they the skeletal framework through which the subtle ether flows. In their mastery lies the secret of life in the body relinquished only by will of the adept when his purpose in living is done. Three are the natures of the astral. Mediator is between above and below. Not of the physical, not of the spiritual, but able to move above and below. Three are the natures of mind. Carrier of it, the will of the Great One. Arbitrator of cause and effect in thy life. Thus is formed a threefold being, directed from above by the power of four. Above and beyond man's threefold nature lies the realm of the spiritual self. Four is in its qualities, shining in each of the planes of existence, but thirteen in one, the mystical number. Based on the qualities of man are the brothers. Each shall direct the unfoldment of being. Each shall channel, be, of the Great One. On earth, man is in bondage, bound by space and time to the earth plane. Encircling each planet, a wave of vibration binds him to his plane of enfoldment. Yet within man is the key to releasement. Within man may freedom be found. When you have released yourself from the body, rise to the outermost bounds of your earth plane. Speak ye the word, Dor e Lilla. Then for a time your light will be lifted. Free may you pass the barriers of space. For a time of half of the sun, which is about six hours. Free may ye pass from the barriers of earth plane. See and know those who are beyond thee. Yea, to the highest worlds may ye pass. See your own possible heights of unfoldment. Know all earthly futures of soul. Bound are ye in your body, but by the way ye may be free. This is a secret whereby bondage shall be replaced by freedom for thee. Calm let thy mind be, at rest be thy body, conscious only of freedom from flesh. Centre thy being on the goal of thy longing. Think over and over that thou wouldst be free. Think of this world, this word. La um e o ganova. La um e le ganova. La um e le ganova. And over in thy mind let it sound. Drift with the sound to the place of thy longing. Free from the bondage of flesh by thy will. Hear ye while I give the greatest of secrets, how ye may enter the halls of Amenti, enter the place of the immortals as I did, stand before the lords in their places. Lie ye down and rest of thy body, cast thy mind so no thought disturbs thee. Pure must ye be in mind and in purpose, else only failure will come unto thee. Vision Amenti as I have told in my tablets, Long with fullness of heart to be there. 
stand before the Lord in thy mind's eye. Pronounce the words of power I give mentally. Mekut el Shab el Hail Sur Ben el Zabrut Zin Ephraim Quar el. I'll say it again. Mekut el Shab el Hail Sur Ben el Zabrut Zin Ephraim Quar el. And once more. Mekut Mekut el Shab el Hail Sur Ben el Zabrut Zin Ephraim Quar el. Relax thy mind and thy body. Then be sure your soul will be carried. Now give I the key to Shambhala, the place where my brothers live in the darkness. Darkness but filled with light of the sun. Darkness of earth but light of the spirit. Guess for ye when my day is done. Leave thou thy body as I have taught thee. Pass to the barriers of the deep hidden place. Stand before the gates and their guardians. Command thy entrance by these words. I am the light, and me is no darkness. Free am I of the bondage of night. Open thou the way of the twelve and the one, so I may pass to the realm of wisdom. When they refuse thee, as surely they will, command them to open by these words of power. I am the light, for me are no barriers. Open I command by the secret of secrets. Edom, El, Ahim, Seber, Zur, Adom. Edom, El Ahim Saber Zur Adom Idom El Ahim Saber Zur Adom Then if thy words have been truth of the highest, open for thee the barriers will fall. Now I leave thee, my children, down yet up to the halls shall I go. Win ye the way to me, my children, truly my brothers shall ye become. Thus finish I my writings. Keys let them be to those who come after, but only to those who seek my wisdom. For only for these am I the key and the way. And that's the end of that chapter. I hope you enjoyed it and um, I'll speak to you later. Bye.